Okay, so we created the uh, ecosystem grass. Let's now paint on our terrain some of the plants. For this same, I'll go select on my terrain, go open, we'll go create a new layer again. And same as the grass, we'll switch this to the ecosystem. So this one I'll call trees. And again, we'll say world standard. I want to go to add elements and right here we actually will add more than one so right now what's happening when we add more than one ecosystem will start kind of mixing them as we're painting along for this one i want have it like a, a area so we'll go with the bushes and we'll go create elder i like those ones plant look very very nice so we'll select one let's mix them around by selecting the same but only different coloring so we'll have it yellow green and late summer and maybe let create a spring we can also try different one plants okay let me see what else we have it uh we can take a hazel it's tpf so it's just also tell me we'll go select different we'll see how they will work very well together and next we're going same as soon when it's preloading so right here it's done. I want to go select paint brush. Okay, we'll take this little bit down now. We don't need that much flow. And we can start by painting right around this area. Notice right here where we paint, it will show up far away right on the camera. So I want to paint a little bit more. And all what I'm doing, I'm just painting the edges. Okay, we'll just go and we'll just paint all the way right there, those edges. Actually, you know, let's increase our flow. So we'll paint a little bit faster. Okay, we'll go right there. So we're kind of going right those edges where I want to paint them. Okay, maybe a little bit put inside the water. Okay, we have it our super rock, so we'll just paint right there by the rock. Okay, we'll paint right these edges. And same we'll just go and we'll drag and paint right these areas. Almost like they're going around the water area. Okay, let's go right here. Same little bit more on the edges because like kind of like almost encapsulating. And more this area. Okay. Let's preview mode. I want to see how well they're going. And you'll notice we have kind of a nice painting those plants right there. We have it few areas, but it is creating nice cover. We can put a few of them, just plants maybe around this kind of mountains and right these hills. Okay, so sometimes uh, it's kind of hard to see on this area. Let's go to hide this cube and we'll just paint a little bit around those areas. So let me look, move the brush. So I can see I'm painting on those islands. If you have a hard time to actually look, we have it other ways we can look on this. But right now I'm just want to paint right there a little bit. Spray a few of the plants close to the camera. Okay, we can zoom in. And you can see right there, it's where we're placing them. So we'll go put it a few right there. A few around this area. Let's go go by the edge. And one is important place actually to put it. It's right far away right here. So this is will help us to hide some of that elements we have it on the back. If you remember, we have an opening right there. So by doing this, it will help us kind of merge them together and also hide some of these 
elements on the back. Okay, I think we're going okay on this one. Let's just save it. I'm going to switch to the final preview right now and render. Okay, so we'll need to select switch to eraser. Let's come closer, right this area. And we can actually erase some of those plants that may be getting too much of them. Okay, let's right click, preview. So I want to see um, mount. We can see right here, or maybe raised a little bit more, but it's already kind of somewhat open. So we can see a bit more grass around this plant. So just right here, maybe just raise it just a few more. Okay, we'll go right there. Okay, right this area. And let's just erase a few more plants. Okay. So it's look interesting this way. Let's go ahead and place some other trees. For this one, actually, I want to use manual placement. We also have it some rocks. Uh, let's go save our work at this time. Okay, right here we have a rock so we can place it, but I also want to place some plants around this area. For this, actually, I want to collapse this layer, create new, and let's call this trees. So this way we know when we place manual tree, it will locate like around there. Let's select what plants we have it. And we already used some of them, but I want to use it, some of those larger trees. And again, if you purchase some of them, like for example, fir will look very good. And it's just as example, so we'll go open one. This is um, the plant factory. So even we put it very close, maybe around that area. Okay, let's go up when it's go on the ground and I'll click down so it's placed on the ground for us. So like right here will be plant. You can see this is beautiful tree looking. So we can actually place right there. We can create another plant like this. Same thing, so it's, if it's placed on top, we'll go up, maybe plant around this area, similar to here, and let's drop down to the ground. So we have two plants on this case. Uh, we can preview, so you can see. And again, if you add like right here, we just add few trees and remember that's a smaller one so they will look taller we can bring them slightly down but now we can add those special details that will create something out of this terrain so let's go select this plant and actually think just a little bit down same like this one just take that little bit down okay uh, let's add some bigger plants in this area as well. So we'll go select, and we can select different ones of this kind. Um, I'm probably going to select something like tree. That one will look very good. Um, also, there an ash. That one look very nice. Some of the plants look very good. So let me put in them. So we'll put right there. Again, increase, go up. Okay, let's select them up a little bit and put it down. Okay, this is one way you can go ahead and place manually. But remember, always we can do this by painting. And in some cases, like right here, it's what I want to do. I want some paint a little bit more in the layers so we have a nice look. For this one, we'll do same. We'll go ahead and open our material editor. Actually, let's close this one. It's wrong one. Okay, we want open for our um, middle ground. So we'll go to terrain right here. We'll go open this material editor. Let's add one more and we'll go large tree. So that one will convert this to our ecosystem. Okay, nice thing because what we used before, we already have some plants. We'll use this one, European ash. And so we'll load it this ecosystem and let's load it some also fir tree. 
this uh, what we have and maybe some yellowish so we have it multiple colors i'll just start painting right layers on the side okay let's go to next i'm going to preload and we'll preload the pine tree okay and let's go open another plant so the more we mix the more natural it will kind of look almost okay we'll go this one and we have it also at lime tree so we'll add that one okay and now we can go ahead click paint so we'll go paint this tool same things let's go just be sure we select our brush okay and on this case i'm just let's decrease right there so and we'll paint just a little bit right there just make one kind of like line going there here other one a little bit right there maybe take a little bit brush smaller and we'll do one right there if you notice i'm painting kind of almost with line so what is happening when we start rendering it will look almost like it's a layers so it's actually a very good dimension for us we'll go right there add a little bit on the edges right there a little bit let's render see what we have you can see we have a very kind of interesting right there cover maybe a little bit more on this area to put it in but we have nice layers going with our plants okay so let's do this let's go ahead and just paint a little bit right in this area a bit more okay and i think we um can stop on this portion and and next we'll add more details to the rock and a little bit start work on the water 